अंतर्राष्ट्रीय योग दिवस पर विश्व भर के योग प्रेमियों को अनेक अनेक शुभकामनाएं I would however wish to spend a minute speaking of the ramifications of this intangible heritage asset to the people of India and the lesson that we in St. Kitts and Nevis can learn from this. On December 2nd, 2016, yoga was included on the list by UNESCO as an intangible cultural heritage asset. The declaration named yoga a human treasure. This was possible through the 2005 UNESCO Convention on the Protection of Intangible Heritage. I personally congratulate you on the achievement of today and the celebrations which you have so deservedly undertaken. And we'll end here briefly with the word Namaste. I understand this means I bow to the God within you. I wish you every blessing and every success. Thank you. This is uh, the third International Yoga Day of Yoga celebration here in St. Kitts, and we are pleased to be here once again demonstrating. Oh. Now we'll neck roll, so we're dropping off to the right and rolling around. If just shoulder to shoulder is comfortable, or if you want to go all the way back and around, we'll take three rotations here. Sweeping the arms up with the palms facing outward and avoiding touching the ears here. Exhale, palms wide, inhale, back up. After your third rotation, going in the opposite direction. Good. Everyone's doing great. If you aren't quite reaching your toes, that's okay. You can always use a strap or a belt around your feet and use that to pull against. Taking the toes as far up toward your wrist joint as possible. So for some, this is very easy. For others, it's very challenging. So you don't need to press yourself there. You'll get there over time with your practice, right? Good. Inhaling, lifting up. Support the low back with the hands here on your sacrum. The elbows are rooted into the mat to help support you and your feet are lifted. Your toes are spreading. Good. And you're breathing. I commit to make myself into a healthy, peaceful, joyful and loving human being. But you slowly build the Good, so planting your hands with your fingertips pointed toward the body, very important. And then you'll press up onto the hip, lift the hips onto the top of the head, and then inhaling all the way up. Good. So different versions of it, and you listen to your body. When you start trembling a little bit, you then slowly lower and exhale your way down to the mat. I like to allow the knee, the spine to reset, so planting the feet as wide as your mat and allow your knees to fall in toward each other. The distinguished representative of the Indian High Commission, we want to welcome her to St. Kitts and Nevis and to this celebratory activity, the third international yoga day. Yoga, of course, is fast becoming an internationally acceptable mode 
for improvement in one's physical and mental health. And we are happy today that we are able to recognize a number of experts in the field. And we hope that through their expertise, they will help not just the students at Windsor, but those within St. Kitts and Nevis to apply these alternative techniques to better and more prosperous living. So again, I want to congratulate all of you.